Now I have two window of VS Code. One is this one and another is this one. If you go here, you don't know which one is which. But if I go at the top, I can see I have this VS Code tutorial, which is the React application I have. And here it says VS Code, that means Visual Studio Code, which means it is just a new window. But I want to have the sidebar first. So how I can go here, so we have a view appearance, but this time I don't want to use my mouse to go open and close the sidebar. I want to have the shortcut, which is actually command B. And you can have that for uh, Windows also, which will be, I think, control B. So let's use that command B. And yeah, I can toggle that sidebar. Very, very nice. Similarly here, I can toggle the sidebar. Very, very nice. But you know, my preference is not command B because I moved to VS Code from PHP Storm and in PHP Storm, they generally have command and uh, one or exclamation mark. So I need to change this key binding command B to command exclamation or one which is just after uh, above the tab. So yes, I can open the sidebar, but now we have a problem that uh, we also had one, uh, you can say activity bar. So if I can go and appearance and there is an activity bar, this one, and here we can have this gear icon so that I can go to the keyboard shortcuts. But since there is no shortcut for activity bar, we can add that. So let's do these two things. To go into the keyboard shortcuts, we need to press command K plus command S. Command K, command S, here we are. First, let's search for sidebar. And you can see we have a command B, and which is saying the toggle sidebar visibility. If you don't know the name, but if you know the command or key bindings, you can directly click on here and now it is recording your key binding. So now I want to know what is the uh, command related to key binding for command B. You can see it says command plus B, which is toggling off the sidebar. I want to change it from this one to command plus one. And now it says one existing command has this key binding. So let's check this one, which is saying focus first editor group. I don't know what this is and if I want to have this, I can set another command or key binding for that. Once again, let's search for command B, not too much, oops, and yeah. So I want to change it to command one and press enter, it will override it. Yeah, so now we have this, so let's close this one. And now I press command one and you can see I can easily toggle the sidebar. Next is for this activity bar. Press command K command S for the key binding. And this time I don't know, actually there is no key binding for the activity bar. So I need to click on this uh, keyboard once again to go into the uh, searching of, searching with the text. I can now search say activity and activity bar actually. Yeah, there is no key binding for toggling off activity bar. And for toggling of activity bar, I can add the key binding, which is command shift and A. And you can see there is no existing key binding for this. That means we are safe to go and press enter. And this time if I press command shift and A, and now I can toggle this uh, uh, activity bar. But now you will say why I have chosen command shift and A. Remember, if you hover over any sidebar or activity bar icon, it is given command shift and X for this uh, extension, then command shift E for explorer. So that's how you can actually toggle. So I can say command shift and E, which is this. And now if I press command shift and X, I have this extension and if I want to toggle this, I want to close this sidebar. It doesn't matter where, whether I am on the extension, I am on uh, explorer or I am on a version control. So for version control, there is command shift and 
it is actually control shift and g so this one but you know as everyone has a command shift and then the one so i can change this one source control from control shift g to command shift g let's move with the command k command s and i can search for source control and uh, instead of this i can search for control shift and g and yeah it says a view scm source control uh, sidebar so now i can change it to command shift and g two key bindings are there let's uh, see which one is there it's having a find previous and find previous in terminal okay so we will change that later so once again let's go to the command shift and g and i need to say command shift g yeah and change it to command shift and g that was control shift g for searching and this is i'm changing to command shift g hit enter and now i close this and th you can see command shift e for explorer command shift x for uh, extension command shift g for source control and command shift and f for searching search uh, sidebar on the search and for any moment i want to close this panel i don't care where i am i can press command one and if i want to close the sidebar i can press command shift and a because it is activity bar not the sidebar <laughs> so you can see on the sidebar we have everything from command shift and whatever the name with a first letter so explorer command shift e source control which is github generally we say so uh, command shift and g extension x command shift x activity bar command shift a and toggling off sidebar you can uh, add command shift and one for the toggling off this uh, sidebar but i would like to have a command one no problem but the last most exciting thing i want to do is i want to move this sidebar from left to right how we can move sidebar once again let's go to command and comma to the setting search for sidebar and from left to right woohoo on the right so it is on the right and now everything is working absolutely fine toggling and every shortcut is there